Meantime, Santa Clara County is still celebrating a significant milestone today. Health leaders say one million people in the county have received at least one dose of the vaccine. NBC Bay Area's Robert Honda joins us at a mass vaccination site in San Jose to tell us why this milestone is so important. Well, it's easier to take in the idea of one million doses given when you see the long line here at the Santa Clara County Mass Vac site on Brugger Drive. But officials emphasize one million isn't a goal, it's another launching point. It's one million vaccine shots and counting for Santa Clara County. Here at the Brugger Drive Mass Vac site, workers have been administering about 3,000 shots a day. There was a spike when eligibility opened up to everyone 16 and older. It's really exciting news to hear that a million people are finally getting that like safety and assurance that like I got today. Public health and county government leaders held a celebratory news conference today, calling the one million mark an important milestone because it indicates more than one third of the eligible population is fully vaccinated. Plus, new federal and state vaccine supplies render the shortage of Johnson & Johnson vaccine irrelevant and makes reaching that vague level of herd immunity easier. We have lots of Pfizer and lots of Moderna, so there's no limitation on availability for anyone to get vaccinated. Still in April, um, and being able to say that we have reached 60% of our population with at least one dose. Officials say the focus is now on reaching out to underserved communities and convincing the unconvinced. It's time for the people who haven't been vaccinated to get past their concern and get vaccinated to protect themselves and their neighbors. Some people we talked to at the mass vac site say that's happening. At my school, there's like, you know, posters like, get your vaccine when you can. So it's like everyone's really like for it and positive towards it. To try to reach the next million or half million, the county will continue to ramp up its pop up sites, mobile units, and door to door services while expanding hours into the evenings and weekends. In San Jose, Robert Honda, NBC Bay Area News.